for you. Keep your eyes on him. Stay the course. Stay the course. Stay the course. Stay the course. And you have therefore received Christ Jesus. Walk in him. Talk in him. Glory to God. I want to jump down to verse 29. Hallelujah. As we're winding this thing up. It was by faith mm, 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 that the people of Israel went right through the Red Sea as though they were on dry ground. Everything around you saying to you, you should be shopped up. Everything around you saying you're supposed to be drowning. Glory to God. But by faith, the people walked right on through the Red Sea as being on dry ground. And watch this. But when the Egyptians followed, they all were drowned. So, so, so all the trickeries of the enemy will get drowned up. All the enemies that set out against you will be drowned up. Don't receive that for you. You're not going to drown. They're going to drown. Keep your eyes on God and know that everything is all right in your life as ye have therefore received Christ Jesus. Stay the course. Stay the course. Stay the course. Don't get off of it. Don't get off track. Stay in there with God. Hallelujah. He's with you. And he is for you. He loves you too much. Glory to God. Parents that love their children don't want to see anything happen to them. Glory to God. And God teaches us to love our children. How much more does he love us? Glory to God. How much more will he not give good things to those of us that will ask him? Those of us that will stay the course with him. God is obligated to come through for us when we stay the course with him. He's obligated. We, his name is on the line. Hallelujah. When you come Call out Jesus. That obligates him right there. That says that you believe him. That says to him, look, look, look. This child believes me. So I'm obligated to step forth for him. I'm obligated to step into his situation. Glory to God, because why? You have allowed him to come in. He wants to come in. He wants to help. But will we allow him? If I have received him, I don't want to miss nothing. Glory to God, all through eternity. I'm starting heaven right now. Start heaven right here, right now, right where you are. And glory to God, if you have not received the Lord Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, now is the time. This very moment right now is the time to receive him. Oh, my God, just, just right where you are, just, just just meditate on this. If you can speak it out, speak it out. If you throw your hands up, throw your hands up, and just repeat after me, Lord Jesus, I confess my sins. I'm a sinner. I've sinned against you and against you only. This very moment right now, I confess with my mouth that Jesus is the Christ. I believe in my heart that God the Father raised up Jesus from the grave. And with my confession and my belief, I am saved. Cast all of my sins, Lord God, from this moment forward, Holy Spirit, come alive in me, live in me, take me, shape me, and mold me in your way. You don't want anything outside of God my brothers and sisters. And from this time forth, get into a Bible-believing church. Get into a church that's filled with the Spirit of the living God, that's teaching the life of God. And get into it. Pick up your word. Stay in your word. Surround yourself. Get, get tapes. Glory to God. And put it on your MP3. Put it on your CD player. Put it in your car. And keep yourself surrounded with words, life-building words that come from God. Get around people that are speaking life-building words from God, not people of the world, because you will become of the one that you're hanging with. So you got to be careful who you're befriending. Come out from among them and be ye separated, says the Lord. Stay with God. Stay the course with God. Anything that says you're not winning, get away from it. Don't receive it because you're winning. You're winning. Don't worry about the past. Jesus has taken care of all of that. All of your past is over with now. You're starting a new life. All 
things has passed away, and behold, all things have become new. So you start seeking out new life with Christ. Get the mind of Christ built up in you, praying in the Holy Ghost, seeking God daily, meditating upon him all through the day. Know that God is with you. God is for you. And everything that concerns you concerns him. He is a very present right now help in your time of trouble. So whatever it is, get in there with God and know that God is making it all well for you. He is a thousand fall at your side, 10,000 at your right hand, but none of it shall come by you. He loves you. You've been called out of darkness into the marvelous light of God and everything will be all right for you. All is well for you. All is well for you. Shout it all through.